Hey everyone, in this video we'll be doing Fundamentals Part 4 of the JavaScript basic section of the Odin project. Click into that. This is going to have us use test driven development and jest to test functions in JavaScript. So first what we need to do is set up the files in jest by carefully following the instructions right here. And what we're going to do is we're going to clone this repo with GitHub. So if you click code right here, you can copy this link and we're going to create our directory. Let's call it JS exercises. And then you can do git clone. A quick way to paste in a terminal is if you hold control shift V and that will clone this entire repo into this folder that we have here. We'll wait for that to get done. Okay, after that, we have to navigate to that folder so we can do CD. It's going to be JavaScript exercises. If you just type like the first two letters and that's the only folder with those two letters, you can press tab and it will copy the rest of that. Press enter. And now, as you can see, we have this entire repo here. After we do that, you need to do npm and then double slash v. Oh. Uh, I think it's just npm, sorry. Double slash v, I wrote m and mp, do npm, double slash v, 8.1.2. So I think you have to be like above six or something, or maybe it doesn't matter. You just need to make sure you have npm installed on your computer. If you don't, there are instructions on this readme right here. Just follow this, these instructions to make sure you have npm installed. Um, after you do that, just hit npm install. That'll install Jest and allow us to run tests. It'll take a minute to load everything. Cool. After you do that, we're going to look at our folders. Let's do hello world first. So let's go into that folder and let's open up code. You can do code period. And now we have this folder opened up. The readme is going to tell us exactly what we're supposed to be doing, but the hello, hello world spec.js, this is the test that we're running. And the hello world.js, this is where our code is to uh, write the functions that we want. So in our readme, what we're supposed to be doing is we want this function, what the function is supposed to do is return hello world. So if we go into hello world, we should just be able to, I'm just going to copy this. This is what it wants us to say. I'm going to paste it right there. And now if we open up a terminal and run this command, where is it? Run this command, npm test hello world.spec.js. So we have a terminal. I'm going to do control shift V. And doesn't look like it ran correctly because I didn't save. Make sure you save this file. Okay, now we'll do it again. Control Shift V, and that one passed. So let's uh, let's open up and try a different one real quick. I'm not going to do too many of them because the purpose of this is to have you guys learn how to do some of these challenges. So let's do the second one as well. Okay, what this one wants us to do is to have a string repeat a certain amount of times. So we need to take in a string and a number. And we can do return string dot repeat num. Now let's look at the code that we need to run npm test. So let's copy that open up a new terminal. Control shift V and that, so the first test passed, but it looks like we're not running the other tests. So if we look at our repeat string.spec.js, we should be able to remove these skips right here. And there's one more. Let's run the code again. 
and we need to make sure we save run the code again and it looks like one of them failed but the rest of them passed the one that failed is if the number is negative it wants to return error so we just need to put a check we say if num is less than zero return error save that run the code again and this time they all passed so at that point you would just move on to the next exercise that it wants you to do it only wants you to do these seven ones right here and i think that's all that you need to do on this assignment so if you guys have any questions or uh, have troubles with npm or jest just let me know down in the comments but yeah hopefully this wasn't too difficult once you learn how to get it all set up so thanks for watching guys